So this is my fountain in the very back. It's basically a rock fountain. And when I got it about a few years ago, it was freestanding. It was freestanding for a couple years until I converted it into, into a basin fountain about a year ago. And here's the basin on the bottom, which is basically a garden pond. And I'm sorry for all the grass and the weeds inside of there. My grass cutter came over yesterday and did the lawn. So, um, I put the pond in, I mean, not the pond, but the pump inside the basin. And it, it's like, I think it's about like a thousand gallons per hour. And, and the water will like go from the tubes to up to the top. And the water will come up by starting from the top and then going down to each tier. And beforehand, it'll go, go as far as the bottom, the bottom tier. But now that it has a basin, it'll go down from the very bottom to inside the basin. So I'm going to give it a test run. Oh, I see it coming down to the bottom. And I know when it comes to freestanding fountains, Everyone says that there's not much you can do about them, but to me, um, you can, you can convert freestanding fountains into basin fountains like this one. And I know my dad did it, did it to his about many, many years ago. He used to have like a tiered fountain, which was freestanding and, um, he made it into a basin fountain. So if you like my video, be sure to like and subscribe and I'll make more videos in the upcoming future. So take care everyone.